The IE250 controllers feature add-on modules. These can be easily added or removed from your controller. Remember to take all safety precautions before attempting to access, add or remove a module from a controller. This includes isolating the controller power supply. The controller must not be powered. It is not allowed to hot swap modules. This is extremely dangerous to both personnel and equipment. Protect the module against static discharge and follow all local regulations regarding safety and needed personal protective equipment. If in doubt of all requirements, see the IE250 installation instructions. Let's look at how to remove an add-on module. Make sure all terminal blocks are removed from the module. Use a T15 TX15 bit on a long-nosed screwdriver to unscrew the add-on module. Locate and use a flat blade screwdriver to unclip the add-on module. Remove the add-on module and place the add-on module in an ESD protective bag when not connected. And it is just as easy to add a module. Make sure that the plug-in module cover is in place. Align the add-on module with the PCB connector and four clip locations. Hook the left side on first and then the right side. Push the add-on module onto the controller. Make sure all four locations are clipped into place. Finally, use a T15 TX15 bit on a long-nosed screwdriver to tighten the add-on module. Do not exceed the recommended torque of 0.13 Newton meters.